Well, he spent a week on bed rest, but today Nikita was put back in action at the Kansas City Zoo. As Lisa Benson shows us, a lot of his young fans stopped by to see him. From swimming and diving to having his picture taken by adoring fans. Today, Nikita was his old self again. A lot of people were worried and wanted to see how he's doing. For a week and a half, the zoo's seven-year-old polar bear has received special care for a pretty serious tummy ache. He got uh, very lethargic and was just laying around, wasn't eating, wasn't drinking, didn't want to get in the, in the swimming pool. Nikita not getting in that swimming pool, you know something's wrong. After hearing of his illness, <laughs> kids started offering their home remedies. The suggestions posted on the zoo's Facebook page included everything from Sprite and chicken noodle soup to a trip up north. Some young person said, maybe you should just take him back up to the North Pole for a couple weeks and let him relax in the, in the snow, and then that'd probably cure him and he'd bring him back to Kansas City. Nikita's team of veterinarians went a different route. They prescribed time off work, rest in his private den, an ultrasound to look at his tummy, antibiotics, and a blood test. You can't take blood from a polar bear unless he's asleep. <laughs> Pretty dangerous. Zoo visitors will notice Nikita's black skin where he was shaved for treatment, but nothing more. You could hardly guess that he had been sick in his pool, attacking that barrel, that white barrel that he just hates so much and loves to play with. Which is good news to his adoring fans who spend hours watching him at the Kansas City Zoo. Lisa Benson, 41 Action News. The zoo is open from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. on weekdays, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. on weekends.